really looking forward to doing this activity with you guys today. Um, it is called Heavy versus Light Experiment. So what we're going to be doing is that Teacher Hannah collected some items around my house and trying to think about some items that you guys probably have at your house too. And then I have a scale and maybe you have a scale at home. Maybe you make your own scale um, or you can just kind of estimate based on just holding it. Um, and what we're going to do is that we're going to predict which items are either heavy or light and then we're going to weigh them to see which category they actually fall under so the marker that's going to um, tell us that it's heavy or light is that i'm using the marker of five ounces so if it's more than five ounces it's going to be heavy if it's less than five ounces it's going to be light so these are my six random items that I went and collected. So if you guys haven't collected any items yet, maybe you guys can quickly go find some random things that you guys have around your house that you can use. So for example, I found a small little stuffed animal fish, a banana, some keys, a remote, a flashlight, and a book that I like to read my... Um, nieces and nephews. So those are some of our items and let's get started. So remember that our marker is five ounces or more to be heavy or five ounces or less is going to be light. So let's, I turned this on. If I lift it up, it's going to actually turn off. So it's um, ready to go for telling me how many ounces that the item is all right so let's start i'm gonna close my eyes and pick a banana all right guys do you guys think that this is going to be heavy or light i don't know i'm actually curious i think it's going to be light it's a banana it's smaller i think it's going to be light so less than five ounces let's see I'm going to set it on the scale. I was wrong. 7.9 ounces. All right, so now I'm going to write over here, banana. B-A-N-A-N-A. -N -A -N -A. It's kind of hard to write like that. Let me turn my body. All right, banana, and it was 79 ounces and not more than five so it's gonna go over here and heavy that was actually really surprising I thought that this one would be lighter but it's more than five ounces all right now our next item let's guess remote all right guys what do you guys think is it gonna be heavy or light I don't know the banana kind of threw me off so but this one feels a little bit lighter than the banana. So I'm gonna say light. I think it's less than five ounces. Let's check. We were right, 3.5 ounces and that's less than five. Three is less than five. So 3.5 and that's the remote. So over here, I'm gonna write remote and it's 3.5 ounces and feel free you guys can make your own charts to see um, and graph kind of as you guys do this experiment as well all right let's keep going I'm gonna do the keys next so I think these are gonna be light because they are pretty pretty light I'm just wondering how light they are all right let's see 1.1 ounce it's barely an ounce oh it actually went down it's only one ounce. All right, so the keys are light. You're right. Keys. And I'm sure if you add more keys to your key ring, it'll probably go up. So maybe you guys have a different set of keys that's actually heavy. You never know. All right, now let's do 
the flashlight. All right, what do you guys think? Heavy or light? Hmm, I'm gonna say heavy because like I said, the banana tricked me a little bit, but if the banana is that much, maybe this one's higher too. All right, so I'm predicting that the flashlight's going to be more than five ounces. Let's see. I was right, six ounces. All right, so our flashlight will go, will it go in the heavy or the light? You're right, it'll go in the heavy because it's more than five ounces. Six is more than five. So the flashlight will go over here. And that was six ounces. Perfect. All right, that's actually less than, the banana weighs more than the flashlight. See, that banana threw me off. That must be a really dense and big banana. All right, I'm gonna do the little fish. So what do you guys think? Is it going to be light or heavy? Is it gonna be more than five ounces or less than five ounces? You're right, I think it's gonna be less than five ounces because this is definitely not as heavy as a banana or flashlight. All right, let's check though. It's not even a full ounce. It is a 0.5 ounce, which means it's not even a full ounce yet. So that will definitely go under our light category. So I'm just gonna put um, fish. The fish, you know the stuffed fish, it's not a real fish. And I'm gonna put 0.5 ounce. So the fish is not even a full ounce. So it's definitely less than five full ounces. All right guys, last item is our book. It's a board book, so it's not like light pages. It's pretty dense, but I don't know. Let's see. What are your guys' predictions? Do you guys think it's going to be heavy or do you think it's going to be light? I think I'm with you on this one. I think it's gonna be heavy because definitely feels heavier than the fish for sure. Hmm, let's see. Let's test our prediction. So I'm gonna use my scale. We'll set our last item on our scale. So I'm gonna read it. 12.9 ounces. Our marker is five and this is 12.9. Which one does it go under then? You're right, it is heavy. It'll go in our heavy category because it's 12.9 and it's more than five ounces. That's actually our heaviest item out of everything. I did not know that. All right, so I'm gonna just write book 12.9. Wow, how cool is that? So this was our heaviest item. Do you guys maybe remember what our lightest item was? If this is our heaviest, it was 12.9, it was almost 13 ounces. Do you guys remember what maybe our lightest item was? I remember. It was our, our fish. Our fish was the lightest at 0.5 ounce, so it wasn't even a full ounce. And then our book, our heavy board book, was 12.9 ounces. Wow, guys, that was a lot of fun. So I hope you guys had fun too. Feel free to continue this on with lots more um, more items that you find around your house. Um, I think it's really fun to kind of guess and say, ah, oh, is it gonna be heavy? Is it gonna be light? And maybe you change that marker. Maybe the marker ends up being things that are more than one pound or less than one pound. And um, your parents or caregivers can kind of help you with that of um, 
knowing how to tell when things are heavy or light. Um, or even take it one step further and try to make your own scale um, and look how you can make that as well. I know some people use hangers and trying to weigh them and kind of making different scales, but scales help us measure um, the weight of things. So that's what we did today. All right, guys, I hope you guys had fun. Um, and yeah, enjoy the rest of your day and enjoy the rest of your weekend. Bye, guys.